Ooh, they're coming towards us. I like it. Oh, I don't like it as much. Stop that. Oh, no. <laughs> There's 11 of them, but they have nine crossbows. Kellis just stod. Minus 30% melee defense. That's another crossbow. Good, dear God. That is an unexciting development for us. He just casually shoots through his own guy at night. Gets it. So annoying. He backed up, huh? Backed up with that crossbow? You don't want to go forward? Thought they would run forward here. It's fine. Joke's on you. We're happy to lose uh, Kelsjastad. We are playing the Band of Cultists, which means that all of our brothers are garbage. That spear is going to fuck up my... Oh, he's not even running this turn. All right. I'd actually probably hit that guy if I got in range. Is it there? It would inevitably be a headshot. Is that a big deal? Hey. Okay. Oh, fucking crossbows. How many crossbow kills? A dozen? <laughs> oh, we prevented the crossbow piercing damage, so he pulls out the dagger and punctures us. What a bro. These archers, I know, they're like, they're, they're pretty good. Worried about Schmookle.
That was a 44% chance to die there. That a sharp knife goes ham. Double punctured, yeah. Need him to break. There we go. This guy can still cross. Oh, he hasn't. Okay, apparently. It's good. The thing is, when they're in cross, they can still point blank crossbow you if they have any uh, any ammo left in it, which is always frustrating. This is why I engage this at night, by the way, because we don't have shit for archers, and uh, this is always going to be a miserable fight. You don't want to break over here? It's too bad. How about now? It's better. You're fine, Langvid. What are you even complaining about? Caravan hand sounds pretty good. The caravan can be converted. I, don't, I think Comprentice can be converted too, right? So we're looking for non-convertible backgrounds with almost no events seems to be the perfect <laughs> setup. All right, everybody lived. You know, there were a couple punctured based wounds. It's fine. All right. I mean, a couple people want to rest for a few turns. Gives us time to bring other people in. Orange rolled, and he is rolling very well. There's no way that's not nimble, right? <sighs> okay. I mean, who knows what it is, but it's time to be on the front. So we can get Nobu in the back here. And another frontliner would be nice is this. Oh, this is uh, our cripple. Level up on Death Dancy. It's in Dom. Great. Go get paid. Accept the mission. Okay. Head the opposite direction. I'm trying to get up to a taxidermist. There's one there. Okay. So go look for heads along the way. Okay, sacrifice event. Gebhard. I think that's our monk. Sweet. All right, actually, I'm not sure who that is. So Kelchistad gets angry, Orange gets angry, Lobefin gets angry, so Sinovu gets angry. Uh, all the cultists get eager. Who rolled well? Darple got Zealot. Mr. Bucket got Zealot. And that's it? Are you kidding me? So the first time we did this, we failed six out of six. This time we have eight? All right, let's check logs. All right, how do I check logs? Uh, uh, why are we in? Let's check. All right, so um, where is the log file located? Is it in just the, the data file?
We'll, we'll find out. Docs BB log. Okay, so it's in the. Okay. All right, let's take a look at the log file. I'll show it on screen because this is one of we installed this mod to look at this. Uh, all right, here's the log file. Uh, this is not very helpful. Is it at the bottom of this log file? Right there. Who gets infected, running around, rat catcher spreads disease, melon thief, food variety, food goes bad, farmer old tricks, vent education, dog fighting, horse race. I don't know. I wonder what is this one? The Shrat Exposition. Hmm. I don't know if that tells me anything. Why are we in? Yeah. Alright, let's take a couple things. First of all, is there a tavern there? No. So, no tavern. So, Rip Team. It was the monk, so that's good. We got rid of the monk. That's what the monk's been here for. No tavern. I would love to do that, but this is why I was pushing for the. This is why last stream I didn't want to recruit anybody because I'm gonna lose everybody who gets fucking set up here. And this is also why I didn't want to. Uh, why I wanted to do the necro savant thing because I need I need uh, powder. Because so far our cultists have only managed to convert one fucking brother out of this entire playthrough. And, it, and we've only had one cultist join us out of this entire playthrough. So it becomes extremely difficult to actually get any brothers on my team who aren't just leaving instantly. Alright, might leave... Might leave, might leave, might leave. Shit, got another one here, might leave. All right, it's fine. Can work with this. Don't want to lose my pikes. Okay. So, all right. So, to put it in perspective, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight nine cultists and we on nine coin tosses we won two at least that's an at least moment for you that's not an at least moment for me that's a what the fuck moment for me so our combined roles all right let's look at the odds of this what are the combined roles chat of we rolled 15 times and hit two That's our combined roles for uh, the cultist event so far. <laughs> so stupid. All right, uh, hold on. So can I do it with the odds calculator? I wonder if I can do it with this. Let's take a look. Okay, number of, uh, this is, I just need a, it's not really a, I think it's a binomial probability. I think it's just coin toss, it's just, anyways. Why did Nobu get so angry? Uh, she's new to the team. Doesn't really understand how it works around here yet. Brings her, tries to bring her own ways into it, but it's really not what the team wants. Okay. 
supposed to be 50-50 for all the brothers. But it does seem abs absurdly low right now. Okay, I don't know where the nearest tavern... Oh, the nearest tavern's Windfall, so that's where we'll head. But we're going to lose. Okay, Kel'Jastad, gone. Uh, a renewal. Welcome back. Uh, Haishi, who's one of my uh, tanks. That's the traumatized tank just left. All right, let's roll on round of spirits. Orange gets disgruntled. Nobody else gives a shit. Thank you, Lurnus. Insecure iron lunged dude. Don't want that. Melee attack. Fear beast melee defense. It's a higher. Do daytailers have um? Events chat. It's a deserter again. Deserters have seemed absurdly bad to me so far. Buy another round, I guess. Nobody's drunk, but not happy. Like I don't, I don't think the double rounds actually do anything. This happened to me last playthrough too, right? A kind gesture. She's angry at seven percent, but now drunk. Angry at four <laughs> percent. Yeah, I know. You're the Levius. That's not what you are. You're Nobu the Unfaithful, I think is what we call it here. Just always leaving. But I'll add you back, Sister Nobu. All right. But we will be naming you that next time. The Disloyal, perhaps? Unfaithful? One of those. He's had a drink. He's fine. Brings him up 20%. Got drunk. Great. He's a deserter. He's used to shit like that. He tells us of literally no events. Yeah, but I think I want... I mean, this this event doesn't trigger for 20 days. We need to update that command now to, so we don't have to worry about it for 20 more days. It's too bad. I don't really mind losing Superstitious plus Iron Lungs. I do, mess, lose, I do miss losing the attack rolls if that happens. This is about my level 7 fucking hybrid is going to leave. And this guy was just meat anyways, but it is a bit of a bummer. All right, so we have to rebuild our party from scratch every 20 days, and it's not predictable which 20 days it will be because sometimes it doesn't happen for like 10 days and you can't recruit anyone. So that's pretty painful. Right, we're headed to the taxidermist, right? As I said, this is going to be a long campaign. And I'm fine with that. I haven't played a long campaign in a while. And I'm kind of excited to play a long campaign. We'll do one where... Uh, because the, what's going to be the, the, the problem with this is we're going to have to perpetually reset our roster nonstop. So we'll work towards it. A generous bestowal. Thank you, Lullaways. All right. I'll add you to the list. A generous bestowal. Okay. Eight for Lullaways. Eight for Kelgestad. Thank you, Kelgestad. Sorry to see you leave as well. It's an unfortunate thing. We almost need somebody to track the levers. Did I miss Alornis' resub? I may have. Thank you, Alornis, for the resub if I didn't mention that already. Yeah. Need to get 12 cultists. Easier said than done. If you don't find 12 cultists on the map, you can't get 12 cultists. Do we need four crossbows? Presumably no. We also need to get archers too. It's not like we just need to get cultists either. Like we have to build a team that still can engage the late game content, which will be at some point. Ah, Sister Nobu's gone. We got her drunk. She didn't care. She's like, I'm fucking out of here. I'm superstitious and sacrifices horrify me. Lobefin gone. So, so far we lost four of five. Uh, four of six so far. Smuko hasn't decided if he's leaving yet or not. Yeah. What buffs did I get from the sacrifice? I got plus five resolve on two of my eight cultists. Nine cultists. Seems strong. Okay. Oh, totally worth. Is it even a question? What are they buying at? 14. They have all the debuffs. All right. Taxidermist says, do we want cat potions? Fuck no. I want trophy necklaces, though. From the stage coach. I want an iron will potion. I want direwolf, direwolf pelts. Okay. Welcome, uh, Dandalus the villain. Thanks for the sub. Okay. 
Yeah, this is why, you know, like the, the Necro Savant hut that we ended up walking away from, didn't fight, didn't wipe to. That one, that was why we were tempted to do it though, because I need powder. I need happy powder for this team so I can keep brothers when this event triggers. Because at the moment, we have a very hard time retaining anybody. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't want to put it that way, sorry, but that, kind of. The brother, I mean, fucking cultists are euphoric. Sweet. Well, some of them, two of them. Like, my God, if this is really going to be this low of a, a success rate on these on these rolls, that's really bad for us. Like, disappointingly bad for us. So, if I were to restart this campaign, I'm not going to restart this one quite yet, because I think we're good. I think we're still okay. Um, but if I were to restart this, I, I'm only, I'm going to have to be really, really cautious of hiring backgrounds that have events. Because you just, you just can't have other events triggering. I need all of the events to be about cultists all of the time. That needs to be happening. 14, right? 14 is pretty shit. Let's head uh, south. Yeah, other people get bonuses, I hear, to this. Um, I'm not too worried about that. Goblins. I don't really want to fight goblins. Do we have uh, orcs or undead over here? There's an orc hut up here. Undead chance there. We have five days to return. Let's go up this way. Don't know what's in there. Can we have breaking morale or worse? But that's going to be fun. All right. So minus 25% range skill, minus 20%. Okay, but we don't care. It's not minus defense skills, right? Not that he has shit for defense skills. So what are we actually working with here? We have 12 total brothers. So we're going to be doing this with 11. And two of them are going to be breaking. Thanks, Kex. I named the dude I picked up. I uh, have not yet. Let's name the dude we picked up. Good call, Sully. Quick to roll. Liquid 405. Welcome. So we do need to recruit a fodder brother in the not too distant future, but I feel like that's fine. I'm really annoyed we lost the uh, Nobu there. Which could have been good. I think we need to go find the holy water for uh, Mr. Bucket. He's now a level two and he already is pretty good. We just need to keep him alive. I mean, do we want a deserter holding on our holding up our side? I don't think so. But, like, these people have no melee defense anymore because, I mean, 14 is still better than nothing, I guess. Does it also penalize the shield? So, 14 plus 20 should be 34, and it's not, so it does. And what is 21 there? 28 there. It's still better. 70 HP. Oops. There's guys here, this might be a bit of an issue. Let's see. Let's see if minus damage too. Ugh. I sell all of my bolts? No. Okay. 
Don't let me forget to unequip them afterwards because they will just still leave. I need another tank here. Not that that really counts. What happened to my heater shields? Didn't I have three of them? Oh, there, there's one. Okay. All right. Oh, we should put the sacrifice 18, by the way. I wonder if there's a necro. See one. There's a necro. Fuck. Man, I hope we can handle this fight. This is kind of close with the necro. Like the fact that there's Geist and all of our brothers are wavering to start is really unpleasant. Probably. So annoying. Okay. Halfway there, Kex, on the new channel. Excellent. Good to know. Halfway there to start. moving now I'm gonna be at least to there it looks like I see that necro can okay it's annoying as shit
Tried to move past me. It's interesting. Alright, we're relying a lot on these cultists up front. Whether or not we can do anything with them yet, I don't know yet. Getting close on the necro, it's good. They've already yelled this turn. That one hasn't, but it's just a movement oriented thing. Alright, I think we're gonna go for the disarm. It's a miss, unfortunately. Thank you, PWJ LaFontaine, for the resub. Much appreciated. Need to kill that, I guess. Double misses here, not particularly nice. Okay. More misses. It's uh, becoming a pattern with this team. Why did I just hire brothers with the uh, cultist background? Good question. <laughs> I had never considered that. Clearly, clearly you're uh, trying to help me meet my goal and I appreciate that. God, these misses are crazy. Okay. Really need that die down. Your archers always hit guys at 5%. Shouldn't be rolling on guys at 5%. This won't hold up forever. It's doing very good. It's doing very nicely right now, but here when battle brothers really took off i like what i see but i'm getting totally lost with all of the mechanics 
Have you made a video on how to play or are there any you would suggest? Uh, yeah, there's a number of guide videos on the primary channel, uh, Locked On In for playing. Uh, and there's a newbie guide video, like how to start the early game coming soon. Um, I think that probably covers it, but if there, if there's something, this is actually really good because if you're, you know, you're a long-term subscriber and supporter of my channel, if there's particular things that you're like, as a new player, cause I haven't been a new player in this game in a million years. Right. So if you're a new player of the game and you're like, you can like open up the game and be like, I don't get what to do from here. And I'd really like some help with that with the guy video. That's something that I'd really like to know. So that'd be really helpful feedback for me, Lock Donut. <laughs> Keep promising the newbie guide soon. Well, the editor's working on it. The newbie guide takes more work because he has to go find gameplay to match some of the scenarios that I've uh, described, but it's soon. <laughs> It'd be better if I hit my targets more reliably. Mm -hmm. For sure. Dang, newbie, come on. I don't know if I put... Anyways. Do we not get yelled at this turn? Huh. You're not even talking like a newbie guy, then. You're talking like a first look kind of guide. So, we're doing this the hard way by not killing the Necro, but killing every other unit on the board first. Also, not killing the guys. Uh, all right. Well, I didn't think we had the damage for it, but apparently we do. that to stop. Just misclicked. So one of those shots did not go to the Necro. Finally. Need fucking Berserk already on this guy too. can still be super bad. Alright, tanking some hits. Good. It's 
Still no kill on that fucking necro. Still no kill on the geist. Frustrating team right now. The necro gives so few shits, he's just like, yeah, what of it? They're not gonna kill me. Yeah, but saying shit... Okay, guys, the, the character roles are random. So telling me dumb shit, like I've seen so many cultists in the southeast of the seed. Literally yesterday, people were telling me I've found so many cultists in the, the southwest of the seed. Like, it doesn't help me. It's random. It's a random roll. The only thing that increases your chance of cultists are mushroom groves. So... Great, I guess. How many shots do we have left? Six? <laughs> Don't be afraid to kill that. Yeah. One of five. Chirp. All right. You did it. You did it. I don't know if I want to encourage this, though, chat. Like, I find it amusing, and it was only supposed to be a single day thing, but I've been finding it amusing enough. I'm like, I'll try it a couple more days, but I'm not sure that I want to be doing this in general. Oh, a million more misses, huh? Sweet. No <laughs> archer. Oh no. It's not an archer after all. It's whatever this is. A generous bestowal. <laughs> Thank you, Care Rare. Add you in. Cheers. A lot of turnover in this uh, this playthrough with people leaving nonstop. He looked, he, he faked us out too. He got those promising two early hits, and I'm like, ah, we got this. And then he just never hit again. Oh man. It's Pejoratin Kastrix. Thanks for the sub. Welcome to the channel. All right, we got there. Didn't get loot. We didn't get loot of relevance, though, unfortunately. I mean, gold is whatever, but... <laughs> 